Epoxy 310 stone adhesive is a high-strength construction epoxy adhesive used for bonding large format tile and stone on vertical surfaces for either interior or approved exterior applications. Flat Epoxy 310 stone adhesive offers major advantages over mechanical anchoring, plaster and wire, and the thin set method of vertical veneer installations. Nothing can compare to the installation speed of Flat Epoxy 310 stone adhesive which increases productivity and lowers labor costs dramatically. There simply isn't a faster or easier system available for vertical tile or stone installations. Building code approved and backed by a 10-year system warranty, Flat Epoxy 310 Stone Adhesive provides a fast, permanent, and dependable system for vertical installations with a proven track record of success. Convenient pail and jar packaging allows Lat Epoxy 310 stone adhesive to be hand mixed by taking equal parts and mixing before application onto the tile or stone. For optimal productivity, ease of use, and speed, the Lat Epoxy cordless mixer may be used. Operating the Lat Epoxy 310 cordless mixer is quick and simple. First, open the clutch lever, grasp the rack handle, and pull outward until fully open. You are now ready to insert one Lat Epoxy 310 cartridge pack into the housing. Remove the protective cap at the tip of the cartridge completely, making sure both sides are free and clear. Next, load the cartridge by pushing the tip through the hole at the end of the housing. Push the rack forward until pistons make contact with the back of the cartridge and close the clutch. Finally, screw on only the Lat Epoxy 310 mixing nozzle completely. You are now ready to apply the adhesive. Remember to condition the material to at least 65 degrees Fahrenheit prior to use, and only use approved Lat Epoxy 310 accessories. Squeeze the trigger to begin dispensing Lat Epoxy 310 stone adhesive. You will see the pink and white components mix as they are pushed through the mixing nozzle. Make sure it is uniform in color when dispensed from the nozzle. Note, the cordless mixer is equipped with an automatic reverse mechanism to reduce drippage. You will hear and see it activate after the trigger is depressed for three seconds or longer. You can adjust the dispensing speed as desired by turning the dial on the side of the tool. The larger the circle, the faster the dispensing speed. By holding the mixing nozzle at an angle on the tile or stone, push the material into the veneer by using a circular motion and using the edge of the nozzle to key in the material as it is dispensing. Apply dabs evenly on the back of the stone or tile in each corner and the center for a minimum of five dabs per veneer. Build the height of each dab as needed to achieve plumb surface. The dab thickness will depend upon how plumb the substrate is and variations in the veneer. Cover at least 10% of the area of each piece. Compressed dab thickness must be a minimum of 1 8 inch and up to a maximum of 1 inch. Once the correct amount of adhesive has been determined for each dab, set the dosing knob to obtain a consistent level for all veneers. Each circle on the knob represents 5 seconds of movement. Set the knob to achieve the desired diameter of a compressed dab. Dispense all the material until the rack drive is completely at the end of the cartridge and cannot move any longer. You are now ready to remove the used cartridge and replace it with a new one. Simply unscrew the mixing nozzle and set aside. Do not discard. Remove the empty cartridge and reload in the same manner as before. on the same nozzle and begin dispensing.
Installing the veneer onto the substrate is quick and easy with Lab Epoxy 310 Stone Adhesive. Begin by installing a ledger board if necessary for your first course, making sure it is secure and of course level. Set the veneer onto the ledger board or lower coarse stone using the proper spacers. Lab Epoxy 310 will allow you to compensate for variations in veneer thickness or variations in the substrate by simply pushing or pulling any side or corner of the veneer. Use a level to make sure the veneer is plumb. Once the veneer is plumb, no further adjustment is necessary. It's that bad. You can then install the second course in the same manner, using spacers for proper joint width and placement. It's that simple. Veneers can be placed as close as 1 8 inch, or as far away as 1 inch from the substrate. Lad Epoxy 310 Stone Adhesive will take 60 to 90 minutes to reach its initial set. Leave the ledge board in place for 24 hours before removal to ensure a full set and to prevent any movement. Once set, Lad Epoxy 310 is permanent and will not deteriorate or break down. While adjusting your first stone or tile, it's a good idea to pull off the first stone before the material sets to measure the diameter of each dab to ensure you are getting the correct amount of material and coverage. Check the product data sheet for the recommended dab size. Filling the joints between veneers installed with Lad Epoxy 310 can be accomplished via two methods. Interior applications may be grouted with Latacrete Teflamox Pro Grout or Latacrete Tri-Poly Fortified Sanded or Unsanded Grout. For those applications where grouting is not possible due to larger spacing behind the veneers, use Latacrete Latacil Tile and Stone Sealant with the appropriate backer rod. In addition, all exterior joints between veneers installed with Lan Epoxy 310 must be treated with only a 100% silicone sealant to allow for movement in the facade. Lan Epoxy 310 Stone Adhesive is available in several packaging options to meet any job requirement. Cartridge packs for use in the cordless mixer, mini jars for smaller applications, and larger pail sizes are offered. Compared to traditional methods of vertical stone and tile installation, nothing can compare to the speed, ease of use, and productivity of Lan Epoxy 310 Stone Adhesive. Visit our website at www.latacrete.com slash stone for more information on this great product and other innovative solutions for stone installation. Latacrete, the world's leader in the manufacture of tile and stone installation systems.